morning and welcome to another edition of HPTV News. I'm Ben Herzog. My name is Ben Lath. My name is Faith Pearson. And I'm Ray Murphy. And now, the winner of the fifth grade workspace challenge is Lily Messino. Lily's workspace got 42 votes. Congratulations, Lily. I know many of you have heard of the coronavirus or COVID-19, but you may still have questions, especially since some of us are coming back to school this week and next week. Let's watch a video from one of our district nurses to find out more about this virus. Hi, High Point students. I'm Mrs. Medecki. I'm one of the nurses in our school district. I wanted to talk to you a little bit about COVID-19. So COVID-19 is also called the coronavirus. It is a virus that can cause many symptoms which make us feel sick. This virus is contagious, meaning it can spread from person to person. The way people become infected with COVID-19 is through respiratory droplets from when somebody coughs, sneezes, or talks. These droplets get into our mouths, noses, lungs, and possibly our eyes. Surfaces can also contain the virus. It is important to follow safety precautions so we can protect ourselves from COVID-19. Your school has a plan in place for daily activities while we are in, build, in the building to keep us safe. Did you know that High Point School has a new nurse? Let's meet her now. Hello, High Point School community. My name is Michelle Tiller and I am your new school nurse. Feel free to call me Nurse Michelle. I'm so excited to be a part of the Orland School District family and I really look forward to meeting with all of you and working with you to maintain a healthy and safe school environment. I hope that everyone's doing well and feel free to stop by and just say hi. Um, I'll see you soon. Lots of changes are happening at High Point School to make it a safe place for all of our teachers and students. Ms. Joyce will tell us about one important change regarding the nurse's office. We will have two spaces for our nurse this year. One space is called the waiting room. The waiting room is located right near the main office. This year, the art room is going to be in the main nurse's office. Here's what it looks like now. The other space that we will be using for the nurse this year is what used to be our art room. Our fourth and fifth graders will remember it as an art room. And this year, we will be calling it a health office. Remember to wear your mask, wash your hands, and follow the arrows posted all around the school. Together, we are going to make this school year a success. Thanks for tuning in. This has been Rain Murphy. Ben Hertzog. Ben Lott. And this is Faith Pearson signing off. Have a wonderful week of remote learning. This newscast brought to you by the High Point Media Team.